Disability is a significant issue in the Lao People's Democratic Republic, which is often misunderstood. There is not a lot of information available about the number of disabled people in Laos, but the World Health Organization estimates that 10% of people living in Laos are disabled. Around 40% of disabled people in Laos are born with their condition. This includes congenital conditions and conditions caused by poor nutrition during pregnancy. Disease is also a significant cause of disability here. Lao was only declared polio-free in 2002, so there are many people living with the effects of this disease today. It is also common for disabilities to be caused by infections and accidents which have not been treated because many people in Lao lack access to basic health care. Awareness of intellectual and developmental disabilities is increasing in Lao, but these conditions are still not widely recognised as disabilities. Disabled people in Laos face many challenges in their everyday life. There are significant barriers for disabled children in accessing education. Their family might not prioritise their education because of their disability, the school might refuse their enrolment, and many disabled children are simply not able to get to school because it is far from their house and they cannot walk long distances. It is also very difficult for disabled people to access healthcare and rehabilitation services, particularly if they come from a poor family or live in a remote village. Most disabilities in Laos are caused by illnesses or injuries that could have been easily treated with access to basic healthcare. Negative stereotypes and social stigma towards disabled people are common in Laos, and people with disabilities are often considered to have a lower social status. This affects the way that disabled people participate in the social life of their community. People with disabilities often face discrimination in the workplace and can find it very difficult to find employment. They will often be paid less than an able-bodied person for the same work. Disabled women and girls are one of the most vulnerable and marginalised groups in society. Disabled women are twice as likely to be the victims of domestic violence at some point in their lives, and because of their restricted independence, it is often difficult for them to find refuge from domestic violence, sexual assault and emotional abuse. The LDWDC is uniquely placed to understand the diverse needs of women with disabilities because it is run by Lao women with disabilities. At the LDWDC, we empower disabled women with the skills and self-confidence to lead independent lives and become leaders in their communities. The LDWDC began as a sewing group run from the home of the director, Madame Champeng, in 1990. In 2002, after the Lao government provided the land for the centre, the Lao Disabled Women's Development Centre began offering vocational training in sewing to disabled women from around Lao. The LDWDC is a non-profit organisation run by Lao women with disabilities for Lao women with disabilities. The centre's objectives are divided into two separate yet equally important parts. The first is to create practical opportunities for people with disabilities through vocational and life skills training and supporting them to find subsequent employment. The second is to be an active advocate for the rights of disabled women by promoting awareness and raising the profile of disabled women in the Lao PDR. Every year, disabled women and girls come from around Laos to study at the LDWDC. Students study weaving, sewing, handicrafts, IT, English, social development and small business management. The LDWDC then supports students to find employment or start their own business after graduation enabling them to use the skills that they gained at the centre to earn an income to support themselves and their families. The training program allows these women to build up their confidence and self-esteem, to take control of their lives and to act as an empowering example to their peers. Since 2002, the LDWDC has provided vocational training to more than 400 women living with disabilities in Laos. PIACAM is a graduate of our 2013-14 vocational training program. She was born into a poor family in Atapur province and her father passed away when she was young. When PIACAM was six years old, she slipped and fell down when running with her friends. Her injury was not treated because her family had no access to healthcare, so it became a permanent disability. PIACAM's family lived far away from the school, so she could not study after the accident because she could not walk far. Piercum made herself some crutches to support her body and helped her family to farm and harvest rice. 
It was very difficult for her because of her disability, but she had no other livelihood options. In 2013, Piercum was selected to study sewing at the LDWDC. After she graduated, the centre supported her to purchase a sewing machine and materials to start up a small shop in her village. Now she earns an income by tailoring and repairing clothes. With the income from her business, Piercum is now able to help to support her younger brother, who is also disabled. Her family and husband are very happy and proud of her because she can help them to save money and Piercum is proud of herself and able to hold her head high in her community. Thanks to the training she received at the LDWDC, Piercum is changing the perception of disabled women in her community and helping her family to work their way out of poverty. The LDWDC relies on project funding and donations in order to continue its work enabling the disabled in Laos. You can help to support our work by visiting our centre, taking a tour, purchasing a product or making a donation. Every dollar contributed helps us to build a brighter future for disabled women in Laos.